ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Ultimate Dead One Dreadnoughts. Spanish campaign. <clears throat> Where today? <clears throat> I'm f I am seriously f Um. So, after last episode, I've been hitting the unturned button a couple of turns, desperately trying to get my economy fixed up. And of course, we have done so by cutting crew training, cutting tech budget, cutting transport capacity. Just everything except the right thing. And Japan, France, and the United Kingdom kept harassing me, asking essentially, you know, give me all your money or we're gonna attack you. Um, I'm not ready for that. I still need two months to refit my first ship. <laughs> and now I'm at war with the United Kingdom again. I mean, ouch. I'm willing to fight though, I'm willing to fight. I'm gonna send three of my battleships into the English Channel. Uh, losing 25 prestige, getting some unrest. Whoa, this is not my... Oh dear. The game crashed, but we're back at it. <clears throat> Right. <laughs> we are so screwed. Yeah. Destroyer division, come about. And we detected. Tell me, what are you? Oh, thank God, you only have two 11 inch guns. We have a chance. Fool's chance, maybe. But we do have a chance. We're seeing multiple enemy ships that are broken. Torpedoes away. Hopefully they'll either destroy this destroyer, but probably hit something there, that's the idea. You still have one full reload. Ooh, good hit, good hit. Something sinks. Ooh, destroyers, careful. Another something got hit. And something sinks. Excellent. Tayo, looking good. Target that very badly damaged destroyer, please. And that's the one advantage we are having, it seems. The enemy is somewhat out of fuel. Giving me the opportunity to uh, engage at will. Okay. Why are you guns? Are you guys, pardon me, not firing at the designated targets? Fine, shoot at the Cossack. God. Let's smoke them up. Because I don't want them destroyed on accident.
After all, we seem to have a advantage here, and I'm gonna take it. Tayo lost her torpedoes. What was up with the angle of the guns? That was pretty bad. That said, with those enemy destroyers there, I'll need to change goals pretty soon. Alright, let's start turning away. Chris to flank. That's a torpedo hit. Didn't see that in time. Shoot that destroyer, please, for the love of God. That is a second torpedo attack from this ship. down two destroyers down it's the two inches from the battleship that are actually doing some stuff here and three destroyers down excellent work really have no more torpedoes. That is annoying. Let's see if we can, can engage that battleship now. A turn around. Am I gonna sacrifice a destroyer for a torpedo run? Maybe. We'll see. Detach. 30 knots. Start your attack run. Impressive torpedo authorized. Lay a smoke screen. You are allowed to disengage. Torpedoes away. That's Division 5. Division 5 is taking hits. Maybe looking at a single torpedo hit here. Two torpedo hits. Well done. Well done. Damaging the enemy battleship and forcing her backwards. Turn. We still have torpedoes, right? Yeah. That's Division 5. Rejoin Division 5, please. Turn. And let's turn that division as well. So far, 
so good. And if that torpedo boat can die, it would be very useful for me. You detach, go in the other direction, maximum speed. Come on, get out of there. Join up with Division 5. Flooding. Please kill her, please kill her, please kill her. Yes! Target is down. I repeat, target is down. Oh no. Fuck's sake! Aggressive torpedo launch authorized. Detach, keep straight. Frank, you fired. 4 6, disengage. One torpedo hits, two torpedo hits. But it's gonna cost me all my destroyers, this little joke. But I need to eliminate that battleship. Or at least slow her down enough. Do it, do it, do it. Yeah, goodbye. Two torpedo hits. Hibernia is at 2% floatability and stable. My god. Yes! Hibernia is down. That was the biggest threat to my battleship. After all, she did have 11 inch guns. This is wonderful news. This is wonderful news indeed. Uh, destroyer, join up with the heavy cruisers, please. I mean, we're going bankrupt, we're gonna lose this campaign, but we're going out in style. There goes the whip. Yo, can we please, all guns, aggressively fire? The turning circle of these ships is okay. Would it be nice if they actually turned, though? Fine, destroyer detach. Keep running, but run at a bit higher speed, shall we? Battleship in the meanwhile was not targeting anything. Screw it, reverse. That was an epic dodge, my friends. Epic dodge indeed. Increase to flanked speed again. Detach Q1. Let's turn. Alizo, come about. Keep running at this angle. Yeah, that's fine.
right, I want to stop avoiding with this entire division. Reform, destroyer, reform, cruiser. Yeah, let's go there. We've detected heavier enemy warships now. Light cruiser, touch, touch. Ooh, hoo, hoo. That was close, although I might have forgotten this one now. Oh my god! Excellent. Target the next one. Detach this entire division. I don't want to lose all three ships because one has a broken rudder. Viper is down. Ooh. we go. Lurcher down. This cruiser is really starting to struggle by now. Aggressive torpedoes authorized. Oh god. Ah! Failed to spot those in time. Battleship, come about. Let's hunt down these destroyers. What? Oh, come on. You muppets. And I'm talking about me here. Udin. It has been a long time, my friend. Last time you were a light cruiser, I believe. Oh, damn, that's cheating. That's cheating. Well done, Udin. Well done. Yeah, she's done for. Can't win them all. Heavy flooding sinks my light cruiser there. As expected, I expected to lose that one. After her rudder broke. Sunny One is the next one that will die, I think. She is taking hit after hit. Oh, she's taking hits from the Lord Warden there. 
First things first, though, I gotta clean out this uh, this destroyer. Destroy torpedo. That is very useful. A battleship, do a turn. We're going to destroy the Udin. Hopefully. And then we're going to engage those heavy cruisers. Hopefully sending them to hell. There come the flooding heads. Locked on. Cruiser Retribution sinks as well. Good. My light cru my heavy cruiser actually did something useful there. question is, how much damage can we do with the battleship before I die? Also gives me a nice idea if this ship is actually viable. Like I said, it's the first time I'm using this hole, it's the first time I'm using this gun setup. A 9-inch battleship, it's not, not the strongest, I think. However, as you can see, we are doing damage. Although that's also with the two inch guns. Yay for two inchers, people. Yay for two inchers. Not a single hit on the heavy cruiser so far. Not a single proper one, anyway. Did my luck just ran out again? I fear the worst. Tell me, destroyers, do you have torpedoes? You do, you do. Prepare for torpedo attack. Come on, battleship. Three of your compartments have been flooded. Yeah, ricochet angle is fine. Keep it steady. Destroyers detach. Aggressive torpedoes authorized. Target there. Flash fire on the second enemy warship. Hashtag awesome. That guy's done for. However, my battleship is struggling. Aggressive torpedoes authorized, lock targets. You have no more torpedoes. Must have had a torpedo detonation. You fired some. And some more. Ah, I'm done. And the other one that potentially could have hit detonated early. Oh, that is unlucky. Unlucky, so unlucky. Three hours remain. My battleship essentially is in retreat now. But 
we did score a good hit on the Lord Warden there. A very good hit, even. Two of her engines are out. Yeah, well done, Nine Inchers. That said, I'm gonna turn my battleship around, because I don't like the fire coming from that other side. And our enemies are in retreat. The AI is retreating, ladies and gentlemen. We are victorious. Somehow. Tayo. I shouldn't have retreated you yet. Oh well. Speed, please. Let the sun shine, folks. Let the sun shine. Oh, I will. <laughs> 27 ships sunk. I lost two destroyers and two light cruisers. That is a bit of a shame. Mendez and Valiante class. I sank the Hibernia. I badly mauled uh, one of the Cochrane heavy cruisers. But their destroyer division is gone. I agreed to a peace deal. Just in the hopes for getting money. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It seems this episode is not over yet. And there we go. That's that. Turn away, turn away, and detach, turn away. Light cruisers, turn back and run. Let's not get into torpedo range, shall we? There are a lot of enemy ships. First torpedo boat going down. Second torpedo boat down. You target there. Target there. That's that. Second one down. Third one down. Pretty soon, I hope. Torpedo boats luckily hardly have any um, torpedo wrench. Uh, 19 knots, please. Cruisers, keep attacking the rear bow uh, enemies. Yeah, she's done 
far. That's the entire Torpedo Boat group. Alright, Rosa, back to 20 knots. Start aggressive torpedoes authorized. Torpedoes away. Activate torpedo avoidance. As expected, a torpedo hit. Battleships are fine now. That's sad, Rosa. Turn away, turn away, turn away. Heavy cruiser Royal Arthur goes down. Light cruiser Hyacinth. Ooh, Hyacinth. Reminds me of a TV character. Terrifying. Terrifying woman. Can't even remember what the TV show was called. Hmm. A silly sitcom, of course. Please kill her. Is that too away? Oh, good hit, good hit, good hit. Alright, next up. Light cruiser group. Mm. Oh, hold on. There is a battleship here. Right, I had forgotten. No matter. 4.8 inch gun does over 200 damage to me. How dare you? And again! 4.8. Let's increase the distance a bit, you. Got the feeling you might be targeting Rosa, and you're blowing up the, the wrong ship there. Alright, target Belfast. Down. If the Brits surrender after this, we might be able to get a lot of money. Then we can continue the campaign. Otherwise, I'm a bit worried. Rosa, back to 17 knots, please. The palace is going down. That looks rather painful. Spartan. 
rows have turned out a bit. And reform the formation, please. Going down. Eighteen knots on the entire division, please. times I love my two inchers. Look at the amount of damage they've done. Pretty impressive. That's sad, those heavy cruisers are getting too close, so let's focus them down. At least with two of my ships, the third one target the next one. Trouble. Rows are over there. And there we go. Start. What happened to you? Smoke up. Aggressive torpedoes authorized. Liberstadt is down. Bits, but. Oof. Well. Battleships, please focus on the enemy battleship with your main guns. Like I said, my light ships are gonna die in this episode. Good hit on the enemy battleship there. Emperor of India, six. Penelope, six. Awesome. responding with a torpedo salvo that the enemy dodges but it did manage I did manage to kill her that's all we need right that flash fire is impressive 100k damage 80k damage 40k damage Anyone? 
Pretty please. Would like to kill that cruiser now. Something like that. Thank you, Rosa. Start panicking with this ship. Here sinks. And the Flora sinks. All those familiar names. Of course, familiar due to my uh, British campaign. Where the Flora was one of the few ships actually lost so far. Out, shall we? Eventually, you will run out of things to say. However, I believe the enemy fleet is completely destroyed. In all honesty, that was expected. And that will seriously help in getting that peace deal with Great Britain. As the last enemy torpedo boat desperately tried to catch my cruiser. <coughs> and now paid the ultimate price. Table and exploded. Or, well, she sank. Safety first, people, safety first. So, 38 British ships destroyed. Torpedo boats, destroyers, a lot of light cruisers, eight heavies, and a battleship.
And for that, you will get a second combat star. Potencia, for your service, you'll get a combat star. Rosa will get one as well. And what was the last one? I think it was the Apostle. We'll get a combat star. We're losing 48 million a month. I'm not getting any tech anymore. Um, this is it. These ships need to return home. One month and my ships are repaired. Yeah, one month, then I get some money from Korea. That will be very useful indeed. Fifty-five million. We're going down to twenty-one. And we sign a peace deal. Yeah, I want five hundred million. And I want Gibraltar. I mean, yes. <laughs> that is such a useful position to get as Italy, uh, as Italy, sure, as Spain. Gibraltar Strait is now ours. That means we can block off the Brits and the French next time during a war. We're very behind in tech. Um, yeah, I know, but yeah. I'm trying. Minus 40 million. Argentina, I would love to say yes, but we're already building 12 ships for other nations right now. I want to clear out that list first. Fleet status, all ships back to limited, please. You know what? Let's go to defense. Minus 25 million. Minus 23. The blockade should end soon, I hope. I mean, the war is over. Hello? Plus 40 million. Yeah, I think the blockade just uh, went away. Yeah. No. Let's improve relations with France. And let us... Start up some research again. Wow. Plus 10 million back down to plus 2 all of a sudden. I want to keep gaining money though. Um, I'm going to need it, I think. 10 ships are being built. Argentina, yeah, sure. And with that, back to the studio, and let's continue forward until something happens. You would almost forget, at least I did, that we are at war with Japan. And 
and the Japanese have sent two fleets, two big fleets towards uh, Spain. One is in the Gulf of Biscay, the other one is about to die. My newest battleship, Saint Ildefond, or something, is going to engage them. 22 knots. What a monster. With strong 11 inch guns and 5.5 inch casemate guns, I am more, more than confident that I can decimate this enemy task force. Keep targeting there. Slow down to 20 uh, knots. And we smoke set. Safe fire only on the main guns, please. Because we don't have a lot of ammo. Considering what we're up against. early hits. To weaken our enemies. Ooh, damage to my funnel. Yeah, three cruisers badly damaged there. And the torpedo boat going down. Excellent work. Leave. Yeah, this is the end of the enemy formation, so let's turn in. Slightly. expected it. I hit on the main tower. safe yep we are still safe just circling the enemy please I wonder what this piece of ocean uh, just right of my ship has ever done to the enemy. Those fish are getting poisoned, I tell ya. Are 
armor piercing shells on the main guns, please. close now. <laughs> Maybe too close. Let's pull away slightly, shall we? Because they're damaging my main guns at this distance. I'm not a fan of that. Five times speed here. A few less fires on my ship, also good. You may have made a little mistake going here. I would say... It is quite devastating, actually. And of course, that is what I want. to turn the tide of this campaign. Well, these are the tides of darkness, I say. I wonder how many circles I made by now. I never really kept track of that. Zumo. Ooh, careful. That torpedo boat is turning about. of a dreadnought. Do I need to say more? Whoa! 
Whoa! What the hell? A 10 incher? You guys got bloody 10 inches that can actually pen me. Oh shit. Okay, that scared me there for a second. Killing the heavy cruisers is top priority now. Although this light cruiser here is trying to attack me with a torpedo, which is kind of annoying as well. Good, good, good. Yeah, let's deal with Natari first now. Besides, I was getting dizzy going uh, round and round all the time. Two hours remaining, so we've spent three hours going in circles. <laughs> Battleship. Darling. Would you be so kind to kill her? Thank you. Well, that's not quite killing, but almost. The casemates can't fire due to angle issues. Engines is down. Funnel is down as well. Natari, go away. Thank you. Backfiring at Izumo. Please. Two casemate guns have been destroyed, and we're almost out of ammo for the casemates. I would have expected it to be the other way around. The main gun's running out of ammo before the casemates, but yeah, it is what it is. <clears throat> and what this is, is the destruction of the Izumo pretty soon. done for. Next heavy, please.
crew losses, 26%. 27. That's the only scary bet really right now. 8%, come on. We're back on an eastern course. sinks. Three enemy ships remain and a heavy cruiser. So, four. And she's charging me. First blood is on me. Destroyed main gun. Yeah, one of my turrets is disabled. <clears throat> I got very lucky, that was not a flash fire. Shastura is closing in. Gonna take one. No, we did not. Come on, blow up that battle. Uh, heavy cruiser, there we go. Now, destroyer, please. Flooding head to my battleship. Yeah, Nowaki is gonna kill me here if my main guns do not neutralize her soon. Here. Goodbye, Nowaki. You did great. Two light cruisers remain, but I'm gonna retreat here, I think. Job done. Let's end the battle with 19 enemy vessels destroyed. And over 100k damage done by my uh, battleship. And then we have a second battle. But that is for next episode, ladies and gentlemen. I thank you very much for watching. See you then. Surprisingly, this campaign is lasting longer than expected. Take care, folks. See you around.